Yep, I got it on. Right now? Oh yeah, it's been on. Jeez, girl. You gotta let me know when we're doing this, Bob. <laughs> yeah. Of course, that's what the edit's for. <laughs> hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Farm Sim Let's Play. Uh, today we got Deputy P in here helping me uh, get some of the work done. He's over on the grass field mowing. Hello. Gonna Ted and get that all wind road up and bail it for me. Um, I figured while I'm down here, I would get some of these bales into the barn and out of the weather, and uh, then get the rest of the bales down here. All right, go ahead, Deputy, if you want to make your intro. No, I'm good. Keep going. You're not going to make an intro? No. Okay. Hey, right. I think you just gave me an intro. <laughs> <laughs> I got All stage right. fright. Oh. Different farm, huh? Yeah. I'm in a new place. I feel all alone. Let's see. Let's see. They say Aunt Jane's ghost still haunts these hills. Gonna make it that type of game, huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> we need a few zombies in the background somewhere. <laughs> Idiot. We don't have a dedicated server yet, but we're just opening this guy up to see if it's gonna work out for Deputy and I to uh, do a little bit of recording. Yep, so far no lag at all. That's really good. I am very surprised at that. That's very surprising for me also. I don't have the best game servers out on my computer, we'll say, because I'm wireless, I'm not wired connection, so things can be going good now but maybe not in 10 20 minutes <laughs> but we'll give her a test run we figured we'd bring you guys along this is about as much fun as a jaw full of lightning bugs <sighs> It's gonna have to get edited out, Deputy. <laughs> yeah, it didn't take long to say it anyway. It won't be for a second. <laughs> what a guy. <laughs> Idiot. Oh, boy. these all stacked up here somewhat looking halfway decent and usable at least the first uh, game that I actually created there um, when the game first came out I tried doing this and I backed them all in there nice and neat and went as tall as I could with it and it ended up being inside one of them beams and when I logged back in the save game they were all outside the building and it looked like a bomb had went out so, we're not going to go that high with these guys. We're going to try to keep it as organized as we can here, though. That guy over. The same with this guy. And I got rid of that little red trailer when I first started the game. 
deputy didn't have the mod and after using it the other day when it was acting like it was roller skating on ice there I was destined to get rid of it anyway and I didn't think about the bales that were on it so when I came in that's kind of what I had seen right there it was they were all over the place so I figured we'd make a video on getting them into the hay barn here instead of going to get the rest of the bales off that field and I'm over here by field number 40 mowing grass Start to make this sound like a weather report. Mm-hmm. It's gonna be <laughs> quite cloudy. I think that'll work. Push that in there. Maybe not. Probably be stuck in my forks now. as smooth as I want it to be. I want to be doing one bill at a time here. Get these three. Oh, that would ruin that stack. Oh, and this stack. Son of a gun. Yeah, I tried three a little while ago. And, uh, that's one of them made it on the trailer. <laughs> That's all that's left on my forks is just moving. I had him if it wasn't for the stack next to him. Alright. I think I might just think and take all these as much as I can. I want to keep them as organized as possible, but I don't think the physics are really going to allow it to be that way, so take these guys and just put them in a the barn. This is where the auto stacker is nice, because you can back right in here pretty decently and drop them right in. That'll work. Lag still good, bud? No, oh, I hit a little spot right there just for half a second. Yep, I just got the same thing I was going to say here. <laughs> The game's probably smoother than mine. It's probably autosave. Man, man, yeah, everything's going good. I'm just short on words right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. I figured it would be easier with two people in here to get. Oh no. I figured it would be easier to talk with two people in here, but it's not being that son of a gun. I have really. It is. I just don't have anything to say anymore. Oh well. It'll be somewhat useful. <laughs> usable. That's all we're going for here. Somewhat usable. <laughs> Recycling bin. <laughs> we can use it to fill that up. I can use the silage blade and just push all the bales in here, but I want to be able to use them. <sighs> Maybe what I end up having to do is just freaking silage blade the whole thing together here.
We'll keep at her here. I think I'm going to speed up the time dip. Kind of in between dark here and. Yep. I understood, but I can see pretty good. It's uh, a very, very light nut. Yeah. It's partly cloudy with a chance of rain. But <coughs> very, very visible. I'm starting to get sloppy here. I'm stuck on the forks. Down a little bit. There we go. Oh, it's getting dark now. Come on. Bill does not want to cooperate with me. At all. I know you might have to get that auto stacker. Make quick work of it. Man, they don't want to see the auto stacker. Oop. I asked in the comments below and they commented they would rather see everything done by hand. Which is cool. I'd rather do it all by hand. Adds more content, a <laughs> little bit more game. does take quite a bit more time but then again I'm not doing this for me I'm doing it for them so This barn's getting a little bit tight. these and then get the tether out. Oh, we got some lag now. You want to slow it back down? Probably a day night cycle. Huh? Let's wait for the uh, morning fog. That'll give me some lag too. We'll get the fog over with and then we'll slow it right down. Ruin that stack. Stack's ruined anyway. There's a bale. <sighs> the wrong way at the right at the bottom too. I could take the top two off though.
the tethers back over in that barn, isn't it? Yeah, right where you got that uh, New Holland from. You're right against the wall. Yeah, I knew it. Son of a gun. Oh, well. Some guys in there a little bit. That guy there. Okay, this tracker doesn't hook up to it. You're going to have to grab the case. Probably. Case that has the uh, forage wagon. I forgot about that mod. I had to put a mod in for it to work on all the tractors. Yes, I believe I got that mod. I've got it, but I didn't put it in. I believe I have it. I don't know why a simple hitch has anything to do with if it'll actually function with the piece of equipment, but apparently it does. It does in farm sim. Your silage is done. Sorry, oh shoot, yeah, you gotta turn that time down. Sorry about that. Oh look, I came all the way over here and left the... Huh. What's the matter? I left the tether in the building. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't do you much good, huh? Yeah. Get some more bales on there. I think I'm gonna have to drop it in there. Guess what? What's that bug? Doesn't fit this tractor either. What do you mean? What tractor you use? The little case that had the forge wagon? Yeah. Why doesn't it fit that guy? Yeah, I don't know, but it doesn't. Hmm. You're gonna need my help, is that what you're saying? Oh, uh, let me try one more tractor. And um, Well, that's the two different hitch designs is that case and that big new Holland. Sure I did all the work before with that big new home. It looks like the same uh, hookup. Well, if you did it with a new Holland before, it may just be me. It might just be the multiplayer going on. I might have to reset it. I don't know. It's got the. Uh, I don't know why it's got two clevises here. But... Well, it's not letting me. Oh, uh... it's not. It's PTO. You know what? You know why it's not Matter. working? What? I turned off my little uh, menu. Try it now, then. Yeah, I'm going back. What, you don't hit the button unless you see it in the menu? Yeah, I, cause normally I have the menu on. And, uh, yeah, I leave that off. Yeah, I turn <laughs> it off and... Bang. There you go. Yes, sir. Oh! Huh. No matter? Took you, took you for a ride. Oh. <sighs> so I can't go bowling yes, with your hay piles? No. Huh? No. That was no. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're all done with that. <laughs> Make good content, me beating your butt on YouTube, but. 
sick of having to pick these up as it is. <laughs> Careful, I got a chainsaw. Not anymore. As soon as I seen you take that out, I was like, yeah, okay, never mind. We'll take that off. Just I'm that not way. the one with the reputation. That way there's not any hard feelings. <laughs> I'm not the one with the reputation of cutting people's trees down. Hey, that's what I'm saying. I've got the reputation, so now whenever somebody comes in here, I've got <laughs> I've got reasoning to take it off, just in case. Just in case. If I remember correctly, Is when I went onto your farm, you took off the chainsaw, so don't even start. Oh, I did. I did. Yeah, I didn't want to. Like I said, I didn't <laughs> have the reputation that. But yeah, well, you know. Everybody's got it once they see me do it, so. No. Everybody's guilty. No. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't work that way. You get out your hatchet if you want to start cutting my trees down. This isn't Daisy. <laughs> yeah, that is your Swiss Army knife. I'm just hogging out this. The tether is, uh. She's not looking as pretty as I thought she would. Oh well. Tether is trying to turn around sideways on me. What do you mean? You having problems with the header now? Yeah, but it's working. It's doing the job. It's just wanting to turn around sideways on me. Almost. Oh, are you going too fast? You know, is it like a weight issue? Oh, it's not going too fast. Is it acting like it's on ice? No, it's just, it was pulling to the uh, passenger side. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it acts like it's on ice in slow motion. Mm -hmm. I take it you've seen that before. That's why I got rid of them. Uh trailer mods that you like. Oh, they didn't give me any problem at all. Yeah, they freaking... I went to load an articulator on it last night during the mod review. And the articulator front wheels hit the tires on the trailer. Uh -huh. And all of a sudden they spun through the air, spun through the air, spun through the air, and I never landed. And then when it did land, oh. it was on the outside of the map. Was that the biggest, that biggest trailer? Yeah. Yeah, I had to, there's a problem with that one. I no took kidding. that one off. Uh, the small trailer works fine. The small trailer, I couldn't load a tractor on. Really? It didn't lock it down, yeah. It didn't lock it down, and it was moving all over the place and sliding all over the place like it was on ice. Huh. I got that all on video last night. Right after I did that video, I got rid of them. They were garbage to me. Oh, two of I think I hauled the uh, little New Holland, was it T6 oh, is the smallest? That. that was the smallest uh, New Holland that, that carries the front load, correct? Uh, I don't, I don't know. T4, T6 or something I've like that? I've got it. I've got it here. All right, I hauled farm. that with it. And got then the, I uh, hauled... Fertilizer on it. And then I hauled the, uh... The New Holland with the tracks in the back. Yeah. No, that's a T8. That's as big as the one... Well, I, I actually was hauling, I think, the one that you have on right now or the other one with the flotation tires. Either way, it freaking, I put it on there and it didn't lock down the load at all. It went all over the place and washed out on me. God. So I got rid of them. There is another one. Uh, I haven't tried it yet, but it uh, looks good. It's, uh, it's a very large, very large trailer. Uh, I think it's got some, I don't know if you've seen it or not, uh, I think it's got a wood floor and it's like blue trim or something like that. If I remember it right? I hadn't seen it. Yeah. 
I had not seen it. I have to check out mod holsters when we get down and all. Look, because I want to get another one. I don't I don't like the uh, stock one that you start out with. The that orange one, one there. It's just too narrow. Yeah, that's the one I had a problem with. You can't haul much on it. Mm -hmm. That's why I was looking for a more realistic version of it. And not more realistic as in a mod, just more realistic as in more realistic. Have you tried out any of those tractor trailers yet? Yeah, I've got the Peterbilt. The interior that of that one. I did a mod one. review. It's, it's not, not that good. It's not that good, but it looks like a Peterbilt. <laughs> it's very good, but it's not that good. The texture is crap. It's kind of like the uh, the New Hollands. You know, you look in the inside of them at the radios and whatnot, and the texturing's horrible. I mean, it it is spot on to how they look inside, but. Just wish they could have done a little bit better job of the texturing and not use the 2013 texturing. Yeah, I you know? wanna, I'd be glad when they come out with some good mods that actually get dirty and properly. Have all you don't the buy yeah. a dirty version. Yeah, I don't want to go in and download two tractors. Uh, huh. tractors one dirty, one in. not. Yeah, on the tractor to use the game mechanics like it's supposed to mm -hmm. and not be painted like it's from Microsoft Office paint there that's the pr other problem with the Peterbilt when you buy that and you start driving it you start seeing like spray can dirt going on the side of it it looks like crap but I haven't I haven't used it enough to really see the end result of the dirty mod so yeah, I mean, either I've got them, I just hadn't driven them much. Well, yeah, I'm pretty impressed with the, uh, what is it, Mercedes? Car? It's, a, it's in between, no, I don't do the Oh, the cars. truck, <laughs> the truck. Yeah. yeah. I thought you were talking about that, uh... No. <laughs> no, I'm not big into that whole freaking farm sim, and you got, you might as well have a Porsche 1911 or a Ferrari or Lamborghini, you know, I mean, what what are you going to use that for? Besides getting from one end of the map to the other. Now, if this was GTA farm sim, that would be different, but... You get robbed while you're <laughs> on your tracker. Somebody stole all my milk. Is this uh, tether? Is it a mod? No, it's a stock. Why is it going? It's doing all kinds of crazy stuff. Find out where you are here. All right, straighten back out now. I got it. Perfect. I got back into my rig anyway. Oh, one. Oh boy. Having all sorts of troubles and I can't get bales loaded looking good and I can't freaking drive. You're still doing the TED and you're not even windrowing yet? No, I got some lag. Boy, oh boy. On. You got some lag now? Yeah. And I can't keep the tether straight to take a full swipe. It's going now, but it'll turn sideways and I won't be getting with a half a road. Hmm, and it stays like that, huh? Yep, it's working. I'm going straight and it's working its way on around. I wonder if I ought to try it and see if it's. Because sometimes I have had vehicles that need to be reset in order to work properly. 
what I was thinking was happening with that tether actually because you couldn't get nothing to attach to it. Ah, oh, that was my boo boo. How much of the field have you got tethered? Uh, working on about half of it maybe. But, let me turn around and go back and get that big old half an acre I missed. Hmm, huh. also turned around sideways. Gonna say, cause I can, uh, I can finish tedding it if you want to start windrowing. The way it gives the uh, viewers got, a little something different to look at here. You've got plenty of work on them bales. I've got four left. That's not the most professional job, but <laughs> yeah, they're in come, the barn. Yeah, if you want to come grab a tether, I'll grab the other. Start, wind start windrowing, and I'll, uh, I'll ted the rest. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you till you get here. Okay. I don't want to get caught up to a point where I have to stop and wait. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if all if that works properly for you, I don't know. I've never never had much issue with it, but then again, I've only used it a couple times now, so that might actually be a flaw in the game with it. It might just be me. Have you used it on your farm? I don't know if I used this one or not. I've used tethers, but it could be it could be that one too. I mean, if you've used tethers, I mean, because I think that might be the biggest or one away from the biggest. I know they were pretty cheap, so I bought everything that I could as big as I could I mean Aunt Jane did set of bales is a double stack <laughs> done every single one of them bales just about a single file and the last one I get is double that sucks really would have been nice to keep them on them trailers but I figured since you were coming in I'd just have you bail up the rest of that and I'd get this done but so just what are you telling bail. me that you are ready for me to come up there and go bowling I'll have to put a pound in on you. Alright, what have you got for... Uh, oh, that's right, that truck. Tractor won't work. Alright, so... Uh, let me let me go pick up the wind rower. And then we'll switch tractors. Oh, wait, will this one work? I don't even know if this has got the hitch. Yeah, I'm not going to trust it. This is a big case, so... I don't know if the big case will hook up to that guy or not. Or if it's just a new hauling problem. I haven't got a tractor around here. That's a little new hauling. Big case. That kind of sucks. Trailer really gonna roll down the hill? No. Alright, I'll be right down. There's a tractor, uh, it's a New Holland right here by the banner. Yeah, that's the uh, that's the big guy though. I don't think he'll hook up. I don't think he will hook up to that guy in multiplayer until I get them mods in, you know. I didn't think about that. Shoot. Went the wrong way again, I've done this twice tonight.
No, shoot. Wrong button. <coughs> Alright. So here's your new baby. You wanna hop out of that guy and I'll zip over there? Well, I'm almost done now. You Two are something rows. else. You are something else, I tell you. <laughs> Uh, yeah, he says only two more rows left. Deputy P, ladies and gentlemen, Deputy P. There was half a field left when we first started talking about it. She just started working for you. No, she's still doing <laughs> some crazy stuff. Yeah, I didn't want to speed time up either because of this field, but... Oh well. Yeah, I'm coming out to you. I see you. You do have quite the mess going on here. Huh? <laughs> Try to keep these lines as straight as possible, but. Oh, I'm get, we'll help. getting as much as. Uh... What happens when you hire people off the streets, huh? <laughs> You want to do some bailing, or do you want to do this? Yeah, I don't want to do that. That other's just too glitchy. What's that, the bailing? No, the tedding. Oh. Are you going to stop, or what? Are you going to take me out of this tractor now? I thought that's why you bought it over here. Are you bailing or are you going to do this? What are you going to do? I'm going to do that right there. Somebody's <laughs> got to finish Ted. What do you mean? I thought it was all Tedded. You said you were going <laughs> to... Oh my, just like a woman. Yeah, somebody's got to finish Ted. Oh, my goodness. No, don't do that on me here. Yep, yeah, it's doing the same thing for me. Listing right over to the right, right. side. Yep. Huh. No, never had that problem, but then again, it could be this field. Doesn't like this field. That is not how this implement is supposed to work. Ah. Come on, giants. It's missing spots, too. Well, that would be you. No. It's, <laughs> no, it's missing never, spots. Never. Never. It's missing spots where I have been. Oh, really? Yeah. Little chunks okay. here and there. I don't know if it's from the lag or if it's uh I don't see any spots that it missed. Yeah, I just, I just ran over one on the outside edge here. There's a couple mm. in there. Oh, so I noticed the one I was doing it too. Might be uh low and high spots also though. Yeah, it may have been. Yeah, this is a little bit wonky to use. Well, it's probably time to sell this tether, I guess. If it isn't going to function properly, it's of no use to me. I haven't had any issues like that before. And it's not like it's because of the multiplayer, because I'm playing on my own map. You know, all it is is an extra guest or a host.
Yep, the lag is catching up with me now. Ah, it's because all this loose stuff is on the ground. Must eat up your frame rate. I wonder if it's lag or if it's uh, no. Actually... My frame rate is perfect. Oh, yep. you're getting the uh, rubber band effect. Yeah, I reckon you call it that. Yeah, like right there was a big frame drop. That must have been an auto save. So my frame drop staying. I know, got, I know I've got better than 60 frames per second because I run, I run my recording at 60 frames and it's dead on 60. That's what you're recording at right now. Yep. That's dead on 60. It hasn't come off of it. Yeah, and that's what mine's right on right now is 60 frames. So I think it might just be the internet or the the map itself. But hey, I don't know. I know I'm holding right, it 60. It could be all this loose stuff on the ground, you know. That does screw, screw with uh, well, the game, and then yeah, it's got to send it to you, you know. Yeah. All this loose stuff on the ground has got to render in and, I guess, upload and register on your screen what's going on from mine, you know. This is probably one of the worst things besides the login that you could do. But then again, I don't know. I'm just trying to justify. <laughs> but it didn't start till we started doing this, so. Get this all bailed up and. Maybe should be better. Maybe you won't. We'll get all this bailed up and then we'll end the video here and then we can pick up where we left off and see if your frame rate's any better tomorrow. My frame rate's good. Yeah, but if you're getting a rubber band effect, I mean, it will not alter your frame rate. That's true, but it will. Uh, what's your what's your ping? At the bottom, or the uh, top of the map. Uh, I don't see it. Uh, what is that? Uh, that little MS number? Mm-hmm. Uh, forty-seven, fifty, seventy, sixty, forty. 70, hmm. 40. Yeah, you are. You are jumping quite a bit there. I was going to say around 40. I mean, even 70 is not high by any means. Played on servers at 140 and I was fine, but the fact that you're jumping might be a communications. Is it getting any better for you now that we're removing some of it or no? Uh, so far it's same old, same old. I mean, it goes good for a minute, and then it'll get bad. Right now, it's going good. Hmm. Yeah, this is pretty much what you guys gotta understand. Why we haven't really made too much multiplayer. I mean, if it's good for me, obviously, because I'm running the uh, the map. But it's really bad for Deputy. You know, it's really hard for him to make a halfway decent video when he's rubber banding. Oh, it's definitely not as bad as that uh, last time I was on with you. 
Was this it with me? Whose server was that? Was that? I think I that was, that was uh, Zor's Landing Lazarus, wasn't it? When I was cutting the trees <laughs> that yeah, night? Yeah, yeah, I believe it was his. I think that was Lazarus. Because I think you came in here, and I don't remember. You were in here for like 10 minutes, and then you left. But then again, that was a different game, too. That was the other game where I had cut all them trees. Put a few grass bales off this field. I wish Giants talked about freaking the updates they're planning on doing in the forums too. They've been kind of quiet the past week or two. I check Steam every day to see if they're installing anything new on it. But so far, it's just been other games like freaking Daisy Standalone, and I don't, I don't play that anymore. I wouldn't mind recording some Daisy, but it's so so hard to record. Got four hours of nothing going on, and then you got ten minutes of constant fighting. Would have been cool to have a sniper montage from that last sky base I had on Daisy. That was yeah, that, that was, was a blast. good uh, <laughs> that was a good base. Uh, but I think I'm going to get back into some breaking point here for long. Yeah, yeah, uh, breaking point. The one that I had is completely off my computer now. It actually, um, I don't know what the heck happened to it. It, like, corrupted, and as soon as I went to click on it, it said the, that an error had occurred and the files were no longer stored. I, uh, heard that the, uh, Epoch servers were open. I still haven't heard that. Yeah, I don't know if I heard right or not, but I heard that. Yeah, you might no, you might have heard it. I don't know if it's true or not. I heard they were still private, but because they were still testing. It's only an alpha, but that might well, be something I to look into too. Well, I think as far as not having to do an application or whatever it was I was talking about. Yeah, It'd yeah, probably something listed. similar to just like Breaking Point. That was pretty much whitelisted itself. So uh, maybe that's all you have to do is just go through the same process. Oh, was it? I, I did it so long ago, I don't even remember. Yeah, we had to go in and uh, go to that website and sign up for Breaking Point. Mm. And that's how we get into the game, is going through Breaking Point to get into the game. You have to log in. Mm -hmm. Maybe that epoch's the same way. Yeah, it probably is. I know the Breaking Point is changed a lot since I played it. But here I am talking about freaking Daisy in a farm sim video. Let's <laughs> play. <laughs> uh, get all these bales done here. And then we will ender. And in the next video we will probably get all these over to the barn 
and then start uh, doing some mixed rationings and go on from there still not positive on how to well I made money you didn't sell anything did you no so yeah I must have made some money off milk when I sped the time up you got the milk mod no how'd you make money off of milk you get the milk mod so I think it's still in game the oh. fact that you, the milk sells every 24 hours I just don't oh, think okay. I don't well, I'm positive there's no milk truck anymore that comes around, but I think it automatically sells. I don't really understand how they'd have cows when you can't sell them for beef. But you can milk them and not have anywhere to sell the milk, you know, so it's got to be implemented somehow. They probably just don't have a a truck. Making quite the squiggles here, bud. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, hey, I'm running into you. I'm falling asleep here. My goodness. That's good enough for me. I reckon if we keep going too much further, this is going to be an hour long video. <laughs> yeah, she's going to be a long one. Empty out these bales. Park this guy. Terrible stack job. Race. Hmm? Race. Race around the farm, huh? Mario Kart on the farm. <laughs> Do one lap to park him. <laughs> oh, you mind. 